Hello, this is the Roblox Dev. So today we're going to be solving a, lot, a problem that a lot of you people face, including myself, is developer exchange rejections. So, you know, DevX rejections, first time doing a DevX, you get rejected. You don't know why. You've done some commission, you earned the Robux, you shouldn't be rejected. So you have no clue, and then you, you start thinking about yourself, did I do something wrong? Most of the time you didn't. If you did, for example, you were getting banned and stuff, you might have, since they, they want you to have a good standing on Roblox, like your profile is good standing, but most of the time it's not like that. Um, other than that, the only way for it not accepting your exchange is that your Robux did not come from you actually working and doing something. For example, you did trading. Roblox does not accept trading. Like you cannot devx something that you've traded. Like you traded, you did a lot of trading, you earned like a million Robux, you cannot dev that one out. They don't accept it. Also, if you're if some people giving you Robux, like through a big donation, and then you you know you want to convert it out into real money, you cannot do that. Since you didn't work for it. I remember seeing you have to work for it to be able to devx. I'm not sure if they changed the rule, but that was the rules before. Um, so if you have any evidence, you know, you've worked for it, then you can, you're able to DevX. So the reason why you're getting rejected, usually for the first time and then you didn't break any rules, is that you don't have evidence that you've done what you claimed to do. Since you don't really have an option to claim what you, what you did, how you earned the Robux, they just speculate that, you know, you might be uh, money laundering, <laughs> you know. The, so that's, that's what they contacted me for. You know, they, they said it was kind of suspicious. It might be money laundering. I didn't do any suspicious activity, and they still think that. So what you want to do, so I contacted them first, and then they replied to that. So what you want to do is go on Roblox, go to any game, go on the bottom, and click help. Once you go to help, you want to search, you want to search report, report, and pick this option. And then go down here and then do this. Contact them. And then you want to report your DevX not getting through by going here and selecting by DevX. And then the problem is on your PC or whatever. And then you describe the issue of being, you know, I worked for commission. I was able to earn Robux and I'm deving it out. But it's not letting me go through. Uh, what's the reason? I have sufficient evidence to prove that I did the commission. And then they will contact you. If they didn't contact you, you want to write it again, since I wrote it two times before they contacted me to give evidence. And then once you have, once they contacted you, it's like, we need some evidence that you've uh, done this and we need sufficient evidence. We, They will say they do not accept Roblox or Discord evidence as actually evidence, but they do accept it. Um, and also, I didn't just send them Discord evidence since, and um, Roblox and Roblox evidence, like, I did send them, I got the Roblox from group, I got it from a percentage of a game, and I made the models that was imported into Roblox, um, like all of that, and also I sent some Blender, like photos of models inside Blender, and then they did accept it, but the ones that are in Roblox, they had to verify that I made the models, that to verify is not like a free asset. Once that's all done, which is actually really quick, um, like maybe a few days, I was eligible to DevX that money out and make sure you DevX in time. They'll contact you to be like, okay, you, you can DevX now. You have to fill in your like bank, like your information to, to send, where to send it and then your tax and stuff. And then you can um, get the, your money. But make sure to do it quick because if you don't, you get rejected again, which happened to me. I didn't do it quick enough. You know, I did two days late and I was rejected. So I applied again, but I directly, since they already know me, I directly was able to get to that page and I filled in all the information and I was able to get the, the money. So that's how you solve this problem. At least that's how I solved it, just by reporting and contacting them and then it should be solved. Hope this helps. Thank you.